Hello and welcome everyone. I'm Nick. Let's continue our journeys. Episode 2, Secret Admirer. Looks like Linda Bro's phone doesn't even take a break. I got a strange message yesterday and I haven't got a clue who it's from. A message? Let me see. Have a look at the anonymous one. Oh, how rude. I was with Rodrigo when it happened. It seems as if they were spying on you. I didn't see anyone there. How did they know I was with Rodrigo? I don't know, but uh, just calm down. You need a cool head to think about this. Don't play along. That's what they want you to do. You're right. They won't get away with it. No, you're right, Cynthia. Thank you. Yeah, you're right. I should deal with this calmly. It's the best approach. If you're still worried, why don't you ask Ronaldo for help? I will. So, what were you doing with Rodrigo? We met to talk. He told me he had something to say to me. But when I got this message, it freaked me out and we left. So, he didn't say anything to you yet? No, I'm gonna text him now. Are we gonna see each other again? I hope not. Are you free today? Oh, uh, yeah. Are you free today? Wow, the baby's kicking. Really? Let me feel it. Hey, ladies. Is there something wrong, babe? I was just showing her that the baby is kicking. Lunch at Jangada. Yeah, work, work, work. I can't, sorry, I'm with my family. It's important, Milton. I promise you'll be free by the afternoon. Cat, we sort it out over the phone. If we could, then I wouldn't be asking to come over right now. Are you staying for lunch with us, babe? No, work, work, work. I'm sorry, honey. I can't. I have a work thing, yeah. See you tonight. Okay. Any news from the boss? I don't like you calling him that when he's not around, you know. No, there's no news. Sorry, true, you're the boss. I'll admit that convincing Bruno to go to Europe to that business round was brilliant. Is the plan still on? Of course, there's a large shipment of merchandise coming in soon. I need you to receive it personally. I'm on my way. Fantastic. Sushi? I don't mind. I'll pick you up at Changada. I should go. I'm having lunch with the accountant. Again? Why didn't you let me know before the shipment? Why should she? Do I need to remind you I'm your boss? Yeah, I don't have to tell you anything. Bye, Dante. My favorite accountant. Are we ready to go? Let's go. Let's get this done. Jealous, huh, Dante? Linda, is something up? Ronaldo, you scared me. Sorry, can we talk now? We can talk now. I don't want to talk about it. Yeah, we can talk now. About what? Yes, what do you want to know? What do you remember about the kidnappers? Not much. Thor and the police were there. Yes, the twins. No one else. And Topo? 
Yes, there was another man. The whole thing was quite traumatic. It's all a bit of a blur. That guy is still in jail. Don't worry. Linda? There was someone else involved in the kidnapping. Are you interested in knowing who? You mean Kevin? Yeah, tell me what you know, Ronaldo. Everything. Yes, I don't want any more loose ends in my past. That person is still at large. It's possible that the police is covering for him. How? I can't believe their level of impunity. Now you understand me. What else have you found out? I look into everyone. Thor, his brother Dante, Bruno. What did you find on Bruno? Well... I never found his record. What? Why wouldn't he have a record? I don't know yet. But I did find out he's known Dante for many years. They were business partners, but then split up with Dante. Dante started having alcohol problems. What's strange is that Osapo hasn't gone looking for them again. It's as if he disappeared. Maybe he got scared? No. No, I think he's plotting something, Linda. For you, Linda. We'll have the time to keep working on this soon. Ronaldo, there's something else I thought you should know about. Yesterday, I received messages from an unknown number. Could you help me track it? Of course, who do you think it was? I'm suspicious of my ex-boyfriend and manager Kevin. He's on the run from the feds. He could be more difficult to track down. That should be an easy job for my friend at Interpol. You know someone from Interpol? We were classmates at the academy. We dated for a while as well. Oh, would Rosio mind if you spoke to him? Rosio doesn't understand it, but it's my job to do this. Do you want to come with me? I'm meeting my contact tomorrow. I'll go with you. I'd rather not go. Yeah, I'll go with you, Ronaldo. Yes! Perfect! See you tomorrow! I've gotta go now. I'm glad we got to talk. Linda, some flowers and a card arrived for you. I left them in your room. Thanks, Drosio, who sent them. I'm sorry, it doesn't say in the card. No name, no nothing. Lilies are my favorite. Uh, no. Lilies remind me of the scent of your hair. Wow. What a beautiful bouquet. They are from the best florist in Rio. Really? Who do you think it could have been? You're thinking Rodrigo, right? Yeah, I can't stop thinking about him. Or that secret admirer. I don't know how to say this to you, but... I think that maybe he's not the best person for you right now. Why would you say that? Hey, you're in different places with different interests. Just say it, Drausio. I'm free tonight. Shall we meet up? What do you have in mind? Tell me where and I'll be there. No, where do you have? Great, what do you have in mind? At the stand, 4 at 10 p.m. Done. Thanks for the flower. Well, no. Were you the one who sent the flowers? Were you the one who sent the flowers? They're my favorite. Flowers? What are you talking about? No need to hide it. They're like the ones you used to send me. Lilies. Come on. They're like the ones you used to send me. I think you have a secret admirer. Even though I would have liked to be the one who sent them. Are you, Rodrigo? Trust you. Can you do me a favor? Throw the flowers away. 
They are not from Rodrigo. I don't want them. Wow, so picky. Are you sure? They're just so beautiful. Do whatever you want with them. I don't care. Burn them. What can I wear to look sexy? For Rodrigo? Well, let's start with fresh and natural. Wow, so natural. This dress feels fresh and the color suits me well. Although maybe it's a bit basic for what I'm going for. I want to try another one. Street style. This outfit makes me look sexy, but not too provocative. Really? Although I could try and tempt him even more, why not? He's not gonna be tempted. But yeah, I wanna try another one. Impeccably feminine. I love this dress. Flower designs are my favorite. I like this one. Let's use this one. I'm perfect like this. Elegant, sensual, ready for a special night. You look horrible, Rodrigo. I never get tired of this view. It's as if Rio were a sea of lights. Your eyes reflect the light so beautifully. But not yours, Rodrigo. Hey, I didn't know it was poetry night. It came out a bit cheesy, right? You're never cheesy. Your sensible side is so genuine. You compliment me so much when I should be the one complimenting you. You look beautiful. Super floral. Flowers look great on you. Now you're the one overdoing it with the compliments. That's impossible. Flirting, huh? Shall we go down? Where? That haircut looks good on you. Although, you seem a bit pale. Do you feel okay? I've been feeling a bit dizzy lately. It must be the stress. Maybe you need a rest. Linda! There's something I should tell you. You let him speak. You can tell me anything. Linda, I've been a little evasive. Surely you've noticed. I don't want to be like the other guys that hurt you. Why did you stop writing? If it was because of Bruno, it was a mistake. Really? I know you would never hurt me. But he did it again. Linda, it's not that. I've had loads of time to think. I've reread your letters a million times. I realize all of the feelings I have for you. No. I don't want to waste any more time. My life without you feels empty. You're the only one I want to be with. Do you want to be with me? No. He's with someone else, Linda. Get over it. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and see you guys on our next journeys.